Today, we are going to be writing the formula for the ionic compound silver carbonate. So let's work from left to right. I'm first going to look for silver. Now I scan the periodic table to see where silver is, and silver is right around here on the periodic table. It's represented by an AG. So that's the element, silver's AG, but the thing is, right, let me just write that down. So I have AG, but the thing is, when we write a formula, we have to have a charge in the upper right-hand corner. Since AG is in this box, right, it's a transition metal, so we should see a Roman numeral. But here's the trick, guys. So I would star up silver. Silver only has one charge. Silver always has a plus one charge. So even though it's in the transition metals, it's always just going to have one charge, and it's a plus one. So that's memorizable content. All right, so I'm just going to say that that's a plus one. It's going to lose one electron. Now I go to the next part. I got carbonate. I see that this is an ATE ending, and all ATE endings are not on the periodic table because they're polyatomic ions. So for the sake of the video, I just wrote down what carbonate is, but you guys should memorize it, okay? Carbonate is CO3 with the negative two charge, or you could write it as a two negative. It doesn't matter to me, whatever you prefer. But now we're gonna do this little trick where we take the charges and we crisscross them down to just see how many of each component I need. This one crisscrosses, down to the carbonate, telling me that I only need one carbonate. And then this two crisscrosses down, telling me that I need two AGs. So when we do this, don't worry about the positives or the negatives. Just focus on the subscripts, okay, when we write the compound. So now we're ready. I have silver, ooh, I have silver, and there's two of them, so I'm just gonna write a two. But now I only have one carbonate, when you have only one polyatomic, you don't have to write the one and you don't need parentheses. So I'm just gonna say CO3 and I'm done. So silver carbonate is AG2CO3. Thank you so much for viewing the video. I really hope this helped. All right, I hope you guys are doing well and good luck on all your future tests and quizzes. Let's keep studying hard and I'll see you in later lessons. Take care, bye-bye.